Hey everybody, in this video tutorial I'm going to show you how to upload an image to ChatGPT using the ChatGPT code interpreter. Right, so as you can see in this example I have uploaded this image. This is the image I have uploaded to ChatGPT. And then using the power of ChatGPT I was able to edit this image in a way I wanted to do. So before I would show you how I did this, I just want to let you know that I have a full tutorial on this ChatGPT code interpreter plugin that you can use for many use cases, for code interpretation, for code analysis, for uploading CSV files, doing data analysis, and also uploading and editing images. And I shall share some of the best prompts you can use this plugin with. So if you're interested in more details, make sure to check out this article linked in the description below. And you can also get access to a complete database of all currently available ChatGPT plugins that can be installed from the ChatGPT plugin store. You can search this plugin database by category, plugin name, description, and get quick access to ChatGPT plugin video tutorials, the best use cases and prompts for all available ChatGPT plugins. The database can be downloaded for free, but you can also support the maintenance and the frequent updates of the database with a small donation. Any support is appreciated. You can get access to this database by using the link in the description below. But now let's see how to use the code interpreter ChatGPT plugin to upload images and then edit these images in a way you want. Right, so first you have to make sure that you have enabled the code interpreter in your ChatGPT account. If you don't know how to do that, I have another tutorial on my YouTube channel that you can check out, but it's really easy to do. And once the code interpreter is enabled, all you have to do is click on new chat, then select GPT-4. And if the code interpreter is enabled, you have to select this one from the dropdown. And now we're gonna be able to upload images to ChatGPT. And you can see whether you have successfully enabled the code interpreter by checking out this plus icon. If you cannot see it here, it means you haven't enabled or turned on ChatGPT code interpreter, because if it is turned on, you have to click on upload file here and upload your image file. So as you can see, the file is being uploaded here and we can also add a prompt. So you don't have to add upload the file. ChatGPT will upload the file, so you don't have to add that in the prompt, but you can add what you want to do with that image file. So in this example, we want to make this image black and white. So as you can see, it's a colorful image and we want to make it black and white. Then once you edit your prompt, just click on send message here. And based on our prompt, the ChatGPT code interpreter was activated. So as you can see, you don't have to use any kind of function or code, fancy language. If the code interpreter plugin is enabled and you add a prompt something like this, the code interpreter will be activated. And as you can see, this is what ChatGPT has done. So it has basically used a Python library to convert this image to a black and white image using a function. And here is the image. For some reason, we cannot see it right now, but we can download it using this link or I will refresh the browser and the image should appear here. And yeah, I, I have updated the conversation. And as you can see, the image we have uploaded has been turned black and white. And we can also download this image file if we want to do that. Or we can also edit this image in any other way we want using the ChatGPT code interpreter plugin. There are some other plugins that you can use to upload and manipulate images. I have other tutorials on those plugins on my YouTube channel that you can check out. And more tutorials are coming up on ChatGPT code interpreter and other ChatGPT plugins, so make sure to subscribe. But all in all, this is how to use the ChatGPT code interpreter to upload an image to ChatGPT directly and then edit that image inside ChatGPT. So as I mentioned, I have a ton of tutorials on my YouTube channel, not just on not just on image editing plugins, but also on other use cases of the code interpreter ChatGPT plugin. And more tutorials are coming up, so make sure to subscribe. And also, if you want to get access to the complete ChatGPT plugin database that includes categories, searchable descriptions, and more, you can also find the link to that in the video description below.